Hey guys, what's happening? My name is Andre Kreitzbergs. This is the Amazon FBA Wholesale in UK guide. I will explain everything under 10 minutes on how Amazon Wholesale model works step by step. Okay, so you can be making those kind of sales, those kind of figures, guys. I mean, come on, you know, it's a working model and I'm sure a lot of you guys are looking forward to get started with this. So I, it's my duty to explain to you guys how it works. Okay. Also, if you don't receive a list of my free wholesalers, right now make sure to comment saying word wholesale is below this video and this will trigger the comment and i will send you them myself i'll send you directions on how to receive my free wholesalers to begin with plus the wholesalers that we use for ungating the categories okay they're going to be 20 wholesalers altogether for uk and us if you want to receive it guys drop a word wholesalers in the comments right now as you're watching this or at the end of this video, however you guys want. Okay, so we're going to go step by step. This is Amazon FB Wholesale in UK explained. No BS, straight to the point, guys. I'll tell you exactly what you need to do if you want to become successful with this business model. Okay, don't forget to like and subscribe to this YouTube channel, guys. This is super important, guys. And if any questions you guys have during this video, please feel free to ask them below in the comments. I'll be more than happy to help you guys out with any answers you know, as soon as I see them, I personally reply back to my comments on my YouTube channel. Okay, so right, how do you start Amazon Wholesale? What exactly it is? I mean, let, let me draw a quick comparison and explain to you guys the difference between, I should say, wholesale and arbitrage. Okay, so obviously we're going to be using a website called eSources to find the wholesalers. Okay, but if we talk about like wholesale wholesale versus um, arbitrage what's the main difference okay so when you're doing online arbitrage in uk you can be sourcing from the suppliers like smith toys okay one of the suppliers you could be using there's many suppliers you can go and use for um, online arbitrage sourcing i do have a massive list on supplies by the way on my telegram channel you can go and check it out if you have not seen it for the online arbitrage okay so when you're doing online arbitrage you're basically buying from the online retailers when you're doing wholesale you're buying directly from the wholesaler so you're doing the same thing you're still reselling the brands you're still selling the same products that are selling on amazon already you're piggybacking on existing products with existing sales rank you're doing exactly the same thing but obviously for the actual uh, arbitrage you're buying straight from retailers you're getting receipts okay that's the main difference okay you're getting receipts with the wholesale you're kind of buying directly from the distributors from the wholesalers you're getting kind of like permission to resell the products with the online arbitrage you still can resell the product it's still a working model but you can't really go and um like you like openly go and resell like you can still do it but it's just it's just technically you're not supposed to do it guys but you are allowed to do it guys because amazon it doesn't say anywhere that you're not allowed to do online arbitrage you cannot go and do drop shipping where you're basically reselling products that you don't have and you're shipping them straight from the retailer straight to your customers that's a problem okay but online arbitrage doing fba is perfectly fine so wholesalers is kind of going one level above you're getting a direct supply chain of the products you're looking to buy and you're basically getting your hands on the products that you can be basically buying in the bulk and maybe even with a better price and even the better margin okay so how exactly do you do wholesale in uk so first of all guys there's various methods that you can go and use okay i teach a lot of them inside my fb mastery program guys by the way if you are interested guys do have a, um, a mentorship program called fb mastery the link is going to be below in the comments guys in the description well in the comments in the description you'll find it there guys if you want to learn directly from me but when we're talking about starting out e-sources is the number one platform we go to to find the wholesalers okay so typically go here you can type anything random here like toys beauty holes you can see i've done like just some research here just type like beauty wholesalers and then you will see a list of different suppliers here like those are all wholesalers you can also, you can actually go and uh, filter out here by wholesalers the little w button here click wholesalers you can see only wholesalers you can actually see dropshippers here as well and you basically start opening up these suppliers and you start reaching out to them okay for you to do wholesale you must have a company okay company that number is not so important because you can obtain that later as you need to get one and uh, so but the company is kind of essential to do wholesale with the online arbitrage you can just simply be a sole trader so you start reaching out to those companies to those wholesalers just go straight down to the bottom and you can go to the website like this one honey pot cosmetics and then uh, yeah it's a weird looking website i don't like those kind of websites it's like like made in 1998 or something okay like pelican wholesale okay so you start reaching out to them you go uh, to them let me just scroll myself down a little bit so uh, you click login reset password it typically says create a trade account some of them are going to be different um so wholesale here click wholesale 
And yeah, call it, call us, email us. You got to be emailing them or calling them. I prefer, I prefer, and I recommend to do both at the same time. So you're going to reach out to them and say, Hey guys, I want to get a trade account with you. I want to start buying from you. I want to start, you know, doing a reselling business. And you tell them, you know, what's, what's happening in the, you know, that you want to be um, buying products that, you know, tell them that you are looking for this particular item, tell them that you're looking for this particular brand and etc. guys. Again, there's a lot of wholesalers you can go and grab. And the key is the numbers game, okay? The more you contact, the more contacting you do, the better it is for you, okay? Like I said, guys, I do have a list of starting wholesalers. In case you have not yet received it, guys, from me, make sure to comment the word wholesalers below this video, guys. I will make sure to send them to you uh, right away after you finish watching this video, okay, guys? So yeah, uh, you reach out to the wholesalers, you make trade accounts with them, uh, you create a trade account, and they will basically send you something called like, Typically, you ask them, guys, do you have a price list with the EIN code, with the EIN codes, with the UPC codes that you can put into the magic tool? Okay, I'm going to give you guys an example. And basically, it will look like this. You'll put it into the tool. For example, I use Scan Unlimited. I'll send you guys a link below this video, guys. Uh, but there is a, a special tool we use for the UK, and there is a tool we use for US. There's two different tools we're using for... Uh, actual, uh, you know, price list scanning, okay? There's one for US and there's one for UK, okay? They send you price list and you basically start scanning for the products that you put in against um, the Amazon and you start, you know, selecting the ones that are doing good. This is the particular whole, uh, price list we took from the US um, wholesaler because I do wholesale in US as well. Well, mostly I do wholesale in US. I do wholesale in UK a little bit, but again, this is the same stuff, the same model, guys. I've done loads of wholesale in UK as well. And again, and this is basically uh, what it is, okay? You get a price list, you scan the price list, you put it against um, Amazon SINs, you start selecting the profitable items out and you start ordering them, okay? Uh, obviously, then you go to the wholesaler, you have your trade account created and everything and you just tell them, hey, I wanna get, um, you know, I wanna dispatch this particular item to uh, uh, to the prep center, okay? So basically it goes like this, you send your products to the prep center, I'll send you guys a link to, um, uh, I'll also attach a link guys to the prep center that you could be using, okay? So again, guys, in steps, okay? Okay, create a seller account on Amazon. You start going to e-sources, looking for the wholesale, start reaching out to them, create the trade account, make sure you have a company before you do that. Get a trade account, ask them if they have price list before you make a trade account so you don't waste your time looking for the website for the products and etc. because it's time consuming. You want to be putting, you want to be able to have an ability to put the products into the actual scanning tool that will scan the products and will easily tell you what's profitable and what's not profitable, okay? Then you take the products out and you make an order on a website, however they tell you, sometimes it's through email, sometimes it's straight on a website, and you basically place an order and send it to the prep center, arrives in a pallet typically from the wholesalers. The prep center will do prep and pack and will send everything off to Amazon FBA for you, okay? That's basically, guys, how Amazon FBA wholesale in UK, in UK works in a nutshell. It's really simple model, guys. But obviously, when we're talking about wholesale arbitrage, wholesale, you can buy more quantity. It's more replenishable. For arbitrage model, you know, you kind of like, you're limited. For example, even at Smith's Toys, you can, you're limited to a certain number of products you can buy to the quantity of products you can be buying as well. So arbitrage is more work, like more automation needed if you want to scale online arbitrage versus Amazon wholesale. Of course, I do require to automate things as well. I recommend automating things. One of the things that I teach, the key things that I teach inside my FB Mastery program is outsourcing, hiring VAs, having virtual assistants um, to do the work for you. I mean, I have a big team in the Philippines that is working for me and um, doing all the stuff. They run my Amazon automation client stores. We do done for you services, guys. By the way, if you've not heard about it, you know, we run our own stores. I mean, if, you know, VAs are important, guys. But if you want to get started in UK, do Amazon FBA wholesale in UK, you literally follow these steps. You can do Google search also. You can Google search the wholesalers. You can do Jungle Scout reverse search method on Amazon where you're finding the brands. Like you go to the top brands and you're reaching out to them and you're asking for them for their distributors. So you tell them, hey, you found the product, it's looking good, the brand is looking good, and you tell them, hey, I want to get, um, I want to um, find out who are your distributors. Because typically you can't buy from the big brands. Big brands are not going to sell anything to you because they're not interested in your business. You are small fish to them, guys. Okay. I mean, listen, hopefully you've enjoyed this video, guys. Just wanted to make this as quick as possible. Like I promised, guys, under 10 minutes, guys. If you enjoyed this one, make sure to tap that like button, guys. Subscribe to this YouTube channel. And um, yeah, this is what it is in a nutshell, guys. I hope you're going to start your business, guys. Don't forget to comment word wholesalers because I want to give you guys my starting wholesalers to start selling on Amazon ASAP, okay? You can start looking for the products from them. And most importantly, guys, you can use them for ungating. They're not going to be so good for the products because obviously I can't be giving away you know, my best supplies uh, to you. I do have a separate service for that called Database Amazon Automation. But obviously, guys, I want you guys to kind of uh, 
you know, get started and get yourself engaged in categories to begin with. Okay. Thank you guys once again. I appreciate you guys for watching my YouTube channel. Like, subscribe, and don't forget to comment word wholesales. All the links below, guys. Join my Telegram, all the links as well. Follow me, guys, for more and mentoring as well. Take it easy. Bye bye.